Hey guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Today's deal comes to you from Walmart. So I am still working on that huge $10 bonus for 48 offers, I believe. I need about nine offers left after today's Walmart haul. So stay tuned. I'm going to be bringing you tons of Ibotta rebates in case you're working on that bonus or a weekend warrior bonus. And if you're new to my channel, welcome and thank you so much for clicking on this video. As always, I will leave a printable breakdown in the description box as well as links to different rebate apps. So if you're new to Shopkick, Ibotta, Brand Club, Fetch Rewards, all of those links are down below. They are completely free to click on and to use. And when you sign up under me, it helps me out as well as giving you some bonus points as well. So thank you guys so much for considering that. All right, let's jump right into these deals. All right, guys, this is what I grabbed at Walmart for this haul. My weekend bonus on Ibotta was a dollar for five offers. I did complete that. So if you have a better bonus than I do, this will be an even better deal for you. So the first thing I grabbed was a freebie. It was this Violife cream cheese. Thankfully, this reset for me. So I've picked this up before, but this is $4.48 in store and Ibotta's giving us $4.48 back, making this totally free. Now, as always, check your apps because accounts vary by region and by what day that you're using the app. So definitely check your app. Make sure that that is still on the Ibotta app before you purchase this product. I also grabbed another Heinz ketchup. This is 20 ounces. It's $3.48 and Ibotta is giving us $2.50 back, making that just 98 cents. Super excited to grab this Chobani coffee creamer. This is the sweet cream. It's priced at $4.28. I had a $1.50 Ibotta rebate. Shopkick gave me a $1.48 back. And I completed a brand club survey for $1.15, making this just 15 cents. Now you'll notice a lot of these deals you don't need coupons for, and you can still get these products for free or very, very cheap. Just like this next deal, that's a repeat deal that I did again. The Axe deodorant, the fine fragrance variety is $5.97. I had a $3 Ibotta rebate and $2 back on Fetch Rewards, making that just 97 cents. Um, check your, both of those apps actually, because both of those rebates look like they were expiring soon. But if you still have them, you can either grab the deodorant or the body wash for the same price. And next I picked up a very easy Ibotta rebate, the Kraft Mac and Cheese. This is a dollar at Walmart and we have a 20 cent Ibotta giving or making our final cost just 80 cents for this. The Fruise Balls, these are $4.97, pretty pricey. I had a $1 Ibotta rebate and then Shopkick gave me $2.44 back making this just $1.53. And I thought this was tasty enough to warrant paying $1.53 for this. We have tons of great deodorant deals at Walmart right now, especially if you have the Unilever coupons. So the unlimited by degree deodorant stick is priced at $8.98. You'll want to use a $3 coupon from the 319 save insert, submit to Ibotta for $3 back, and 10 cents back for buying any brand deodorant and submit to Shopkick, I got back $2.26, making this just 62 cents. The unlimited by degree dry spray deodorant is $9.98. So you'll want to use a separate $3 coupon from the 319 save, submit to Ibotta for a separate $3 rebate and submit to Shopkick, I got back $2.26, making this just $1.72. The Degree Men and Degree Women's Dry Spray Deodorants are both $5.78. You'll want to use two $1.50 coupons from the 319 Save Insert. Submit to Ibotta, get a dollar back for each, and that counts as two separate rebates on Ibotta. Submit to Shopkick and get back $2.26 a piece, and that will make your final cost $1.02 for each of these. 
Over here, the Dreft Laundry Stain Remover is priced at $3.97. I had a $1.50 Ibotta rebate and then completed a Brand Club survey for $1.25, making this just $1.22. The old El Paso taco seasonings are 88 cents a piece. Two of them would cost $1.76. I submitted two Ibotta and got back 40 cents for buying two. And that made my final cost just 68 cents a piece. And next to that, the stand and stuff shells, the 10 count are 224. I submitted two Ibotta and got 50 cents back, making this just $1.74. The Dove Hand Wash are $3.97. If you grab two, that would cost $7.94 before coupons. But if you have that buy one, get one free coupon from the $3.19 save, you will want to use that. It will take off $3.97. Mine scanned perfectly fine at the self-checkout. I was shocked. I thought for sure that it was going to beep, but it went through no issues. Then I submitted to Ibotta, got a dollar back for each of these and submitted to Fetch Rewards and also got a dollar back for each of these, making these free and a three cent money maker. So excited about that deal. Another deal I was really excited about was on the Hefty Slider Bags. So you can grab any that are 10 count and up. These were the cheapest at my store. So the 20 count gallon bags, these are priced at 278 a piece. So two of them would cost 556. We have $2 back on Ibotta for buying two or $2 back for buying two on the coupons app. Unfortunately, we can't combine those, but submit to either one. Your final cost will be just $1.78 per bag. The Listerine mouthwash travel size is $1.97. I submitted to Ibotta and got back 10 cents for buying any brand mouthwash and completed a brand club survey for $1.25, making this just 62 cents. The Curad wraps are priced at $1.97, and we have a Shopkick rebate giving us $2.26 back, making this free and a 29 cent money maker. And finally, this Cotton L6 Mega Roll toilet paper is $6.98. I submitted to Shopkick, got $2.04 back, and completed a brand club survey for $1.25, making this just $3.69. If you haven't yet printed from cottonelle.com, you can print printable coupons. Mine were a dollar off, but I had already printed all of mine and used them. But if you have that dollar off printable, your final cost would be just $2.69. So my total value for 21 items was $87.09 worth of products. Subtotal after coupons was $74.12. You can use gift cards to pay. I got back a total of $28.28 .28 from Ibotta, $17.26 from Shopkick, $4.90 from Brand Club, and $4.60 from Fetch making my final cost $19.08 or about 91 cents per item, which I'm very happy with. I would pay 91 cents for any of these products. I also wanted to share with you guys really quickly, um, just some cheap coffee that I found. So this McCafe Blueberry Muffin 24 K cups, this was on sale at my store and it was, I believe, I don't have the receipt in front of me. I believe it was $12.68. So these are normally like $14.92 or something like that. And if you buy two of these, you can submit to Swagbucks. We have $9 back when you buy two. So I thought that was just a really a great deal to share with you guys. I didn't figure that into the rest of my couponing haul because it was a little bit of a splurge. Um, and something I just genuinely was out of, so I needed some coffees. But that Swagbucks rebate is good on lots of different kinds of coffees. So if you don't like the blueberry muffin, there are other varieties that you could get and still use that Swagbucks offer. All right, guys, let me know if you have any questions down in the comments below. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it. 
And if you haven't yet already, please feel free to subscribe and share this video with friends and family who are also trying to save money. Thank you again so, so much for watching. And until next time, guys, happy couponing.